Hi, welcome to the eGen Solutions YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to show you a little tool that's going to help you create these easy quotes for your social media posts. Now, this tool is perfect for podcasters, small business owners, and those working on your personal branding. It's a complete game changer. So if this sounds like something that would interest you, let's get over to the desktop. Here we are at glasp.co. I'm going to leave the link in the description of the video as well. Glasp is a social highlighting highlighter for the web. And actually you can use this for a lot of things. You can use it for your Kindle. You can use it for YouTube videos. You can use it for PDFs. And basically what it does is it allows you to highlight things that you like. So if you're a Kindle user, you pretty much already know that you can go in there. And if you find something in a book, you can highlight that, right? Well, this is the same concept only it's for the web. It's everywhere, which I love. But what I love even more about this is that you can use it for your YouTube videos, your podcasts and everything else. And I'm going to show you how to do that. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go into glass here and you're going to sign up, sign up and do everything that they're asking you to do. And then you're going to install the Chrome extension or install it on Safari. So I'm going to go ahead here and log in and we'll come to the dashboard. Now, the dashboard has a ton of things. This little tool, I'm showing you just one thing, but there are a million things you can do with this. Today, I'm just gonna show you how to, how to highlight something and then use it as a social media post. Very easy to do, and I'm even gonna show you how you can brand it even more using Canva. So, what we're gonna do is I've kind of set everything up already. Now, remember I mentioned that we could highlight YouTube videos. That's what we're gonna do today. So for this particular one, I found a Tony Robbins video that I like. Now, for you as a podcaster, if you're doing your podcast in video form or on YouTube, you will get this cute little uh, transcript and summary from Glasp when you install the extension. You'll have that. It automatically translates everything or transcribes everything for you and gives you a summary. What we're gonna do today is we're gonna look through the transcription that Glass provided of this video. In there, there is a quote that I like that says, leaders anticipate, losers react. Now this is a Tony Robbins video. It's him in it, we're not gonna play it. Um, as you can see, when I highlight this, it brings up a toolbar. And this little toolbar has a couple of different options. Today we're gonna uh, select the quotes. And I'm just going to go ahead and select that and look at this. This is so exciting. This is the quote that I highlighted and it also uh, incorporates the source that I pulled that quote from. Love this. Now it'll automatically set this up for square, but it has the option to do a landscape as well. Mostly you'll probably use the square and it also gives you some really cool colors here that are presets that you can go ahead and use as well. Now, the other thing you can do is of course you can change it if you don't want the italics, you can change, deselect that, or you could take out the little quotes. I like it just as it is. And if you wish, you can leave it just like this and you can download it, upload it to your social media, or you can connect to your Facebook and X account and connect those as well. However, for today, I'm gonna show you how to take this over to Canva and brand it to your colors. So I'm gonna change it back to white and go ahead and download this. I've actually already done that. We're gonna come over here to Canva. Now to make things easier, I have set up the Instagram template. You can easily search that when you start in Canva, just put Instagram post and it will set up a blank one for you. I have uploaded the, uh, Vid, uh, the quote here, but now I want to use my brand colors. So I have my brand colors already set up. I'm going to select this yellow. I'm going to come back over here to the upload and I'm going to drag that quote over. Now, obviously this doesn't look too good, right? We probably are not going to have this white background. It doesn't look good. It's very easy to fix. We're going to go over to our magic studio and <laughs> remove the background. How cool is that? So once we have that background removed, we're gonna come back and you can see how it's placed very nicely into this 
template. Now we're going to keep moving this, making sure that it fits and you know, you can make it smaller or however you want. Then we'll come down to our logos and we will just type in or bring over a logo that we want and place it down here. Super easy. It's a branded quote. I love it. And if you want to just move things up, of course, just to make things centered a little bit, that's great. Download that, upload, upload that to your social media and voila. So that is a great way to take your quotes or to take little things that you have found through the internet and put it into some sort of social media post that you can easily share. I like that they have it. If you don't even need to come over to Canva, but if you want to keep consistent with your consistent branding and your colors, then this would be the way that you'd want to do that. All right. I hope this has helped you. And at least it gives you a little uh, extra way to create some extra content for your social media posts. And as always, if this helped you, thumbs up is greatly appreciated. If you're a subscriber, thank you. I will see you again in the next video.